how do presentation analytics work? Well, I want to show you a quick preview and hopefully get you excited so that you'll uh, see some of the applications for our webinar next week. So I'm going to dive into some screen sharing here. And I've got my Prezi dashboard and all my various presentations this is one of our amazing clients, J.R. Butler. And I'm going to click on this little drill out screen here. And I'm just going to simply choose create a new link. That's going to generate an analytics link. And I go my awesome LinkedIn viewers. And so I just name that my campaign, whatever I want to call it, if it's a person's name, if it's a company name or both, I've got the option then of course to track it. And I can require a viewer name and email address. I'm going to leave that unchecked for now. So I just click create a link and there's a link right there that I can copy. I can paste that in an email. I can send it over some sort of messaging tool. It's really that simple. No uh, uploading a presentation to uh, some sort of file sharing tool. Okay, and now I'm gonna bring up an incognito window, which is basically just simulating someone viewing it who's not logged into my Prezi dashboard. I'm gonna paste that there. And you're gonna see the presentation loading up. And to the viewer, it just looks like a normal link. And I'm gonna choose present. And that's gonna start loading my Prezi presentation. And as a viewer, I don't need to be logged in. I just bring, up it, bring it up in any web browser and I'm able to start accessing that Prezi information. So you'll see this content starting to load right here. And I'm gonna just start clicking forward. And I can start navigating my Prezi presentation. You'll see some of the photos from our J.R. Butler presentation here. So again, for the viewer, it looks just like a normal presentation sequence, like they're viewing it. You still have kind of that dynamicism with Prezi. You've got the movement, the ability to jump in and out of sections. And uh, it's a very dynamic experience versus someone sending you like a slideshow or a PDF and having to go through it that way. So uh, now that I've clicked through a few of these, I want to show you what's happening on the back end. So if I jump back to my logged in dashboard, I just generated that link, as you'll recall. And then check this out here. It's actually showing me in real time that someone is on air viewing my Prezi presentation. And not only that, I'm actually collecting data on which slides they're viewing and for how long. You can see I can actually mouse over and get a second breakdown of each of those slides that the viewer has checked out. So obviously this can really inform you as a salesperson, as a marketer, really as anyone who's ever sharing presentation content. And this is this viewer one area here. That would be if I did require name and email address, that's where that information would show up as well. And if additional viewers came in, they would just be tracked here on that dashboard. So really powerful information as you can imagine. That's a quick look at the Prezi uh, analytics dashboard. I'm gonna be talking about all kinds of strategies to leverage that for sales purposes, for marketing purposes, promotional purposes. So I, I hope you join me for the webinar. That's going to be Wednesday, April 25th and I will hopefully see you there. Thanks again. Cheers.